So here's a kinetics problem uh, we can work out for a second order reaction. Uh, it involves the gas phase decomposition of hydrogen iodide. Um, it does follow a second order reaction and what we want to know is we want to know how much time it takes for the concentration of HI in this reaction to drop from 0 0.010 molar to 0 0.005 molar uh, at 443 degrees Celsius. Uh, the temperature isn't important, we just need to state it because we do have a K given to us and we have a K of 30.0 uh, uh, inverse molar inverse minutes and so that K is valid for that temperature. And so we see that we have a second order reaction. The first thing we want to do is just write down the information that we're given. So we know that the concentration of HI at time zero is equal to 0 0.010 molar. I know the concentration of HI at some time t is equal to 0 0.0050 molar. We're going to be looking for that t. Uh, we know the value of k up here, and what we're looking for is t equals what? So uh, let's go ahead and solve that. So the equation that we want to use is 1 over, we have concentration of HI time t minus 1 over concentration of HI at time 0 and that's going to be equal to K times T. Okay, So let's go ahead and, uh, and plug that in and so what we end up with is 1 over 0 0.0050 molar minus 1 over 0 0.010 molar that's equal to 30.0 inverse molar inverse minute times our time. And so this value here uh, becomes 200. So we have 200 inverse molar minus 100 inverse molar is equal to 30.0 Polarity minus 1, minutes to the minus 1, times t. That side didn't change at all. Well, this should have a molar there. There we go. So now we have 100 inverse molarity is equal to 30.0 inverse molarity inverse minutes times t. And now I can just divide by my 30.0 inverse molarity inverse minutes. The inverse molarities are going to cancel, and the inverse minutes, when divided, is going to become minutes, and so we end up with 3.33 minutes is equal to 0.0050. 